Hello you guys and welcome back to a let's play of Mickey Speedway USA. This is Cyborg Bowser here and today we are going to be not necessarily doing a Grand Prix. We're going to be using Louie because why not? But we're actually going to be taking on the contest mode today. And I am genuinely excited for this. Because this is something that doesn't involve, like, any Grand Prix racing or anything like that. It's it's laid back and chill and all that. But while this is going, well, first off, let me go ahead by saying that essentially contest mode is like battle mode from Mario Kart. You start with three balloons and if you lose them, well, you lose. Although, you'll still get points for it, but... I don't know. This is a weird mode. Um... I want to start off by saying that... I had a blast with recording Mickey Speedway USA. I had a blast in many different regards. Mainly because of the nostalgia, but there's more to it than just... The nostalgic purposes of a game. The purpose of the game is also to enjoy what you're playing, as well as to feel comfortable enough with it to just say anything and be alright with it. So, I feel like in that regard, I succeeded. But, I want to know what you guys thought of this project. Did you like it? Did you... Did you not? And if you didn't like it, what did you think went wrong? I mean, I know there's going to be some parts that are wrong, but... <laughs> um, I'm kind of already expecting that. And I would hit that baseball. That was kind of a dumb move to do there. But... Let me preface by saying that... Mickey Speedway USA is... Definitely a good game. For its time. Well, for its time, there was, like, Mario Kart clones, for sure. And, in that case, nothing could top Mario Kart 64. Stuff like Cruising USA and another Rareware game, known as Diddy Kong Racing, also popped up. As well as another game that I might do eventually, LEGO Racers. Actually, I know I'm gonna do that one, but when I'm gonna do it is a different story. But that's another game that I was interested in at the time. And while I did like Mario Kart for um, for its multiplayer and whatnot, and its track design, this game I felt did a lot better in the single player aspect. Definitely. And did that this and Diddy Kong Racing, both of them did a very good job and actually started that up. Um but a lot of people will say this is Rareware's weakest release. I mean, I can see it since it's a racing game. But then again, they were also the ones behind Diddy Kong Racing. I keep referencing that and I probably shouldn't, but it's true. Um, I'm not a big Rareware fanatic though. I'm not that big into them. I do like their games, however. That is something I can agree on. And based on my own bias, I guess you could say, I genuinely like this game. But it also takes a lot of practice, too. This is a game that that I would spend hours, among hours, playing. And I enjoyed it from front to back. I never did complete it, like, all the way through mirror mode. I did, however, complete it on professional, which was the story pretty much um I would recommend this game but be aware it does get pretty difficult later on and it's not like Diddy Kong racing difficult and I'll explain that a bit later but it's not that difficult at least in my eyes but it definitely takes a certain amount of precision a certain amount of practice and, uh, yeah. So now we're just entering the arena. 
out of all the battle modes, this is probably my favorite. And to be fair, I mean, first off, this music, and I jumped over someone. That's awesome. And you can slow down, too, without realizing it. So, this is a pretty competitive area, if you're not careful. And even with invincibility, you're not guaranteed to go through there. But, yeah, I would say I thoroughly enjoyed this game. Of course, contest mode, the one I'm doing right now, while it's good, I feel like could have been a bit more, not necessarily polished, but in some respects, maybe so. It's kind of hard to say, really, because this is essentially the battle mode of this game, and... It's a shame I have to speed some of that up because, well, it was getting too long. It took at least another minute, considering there were only like two of us left. <laughs> so if you notice a bit of a cut there, that's probably why. But, yeah, now we're going to enter our last contest area, our last little mode, if you feel so inclined. The Steamboat. I don't know why they made this one a battle mode, but I will admit, this gets pretty intense. Like, there's nothing, there's nothing else I could say about it. Ooh, that actually did get me, but screw whoever did that. <laughs> Ooh, wow, I'm getting a lot of insensibilities now. Um, I don't know why that is, but okay, whatever. So let's try and take some guys out. So yeah, I'm not going to take anything off for the contest mode. If anything, it did what it set out to do, at least a long time ago. Um, nowadays, this is kind of an outdated game, for sure. But it still has its charm to it, and even in 2015, I still enjoy it. So I recommend it. It's very challenging, though, so you gotta be careful about that. But, yeah. Okay. Okay, so now it's just Donald. Yeah, me against Donald, but this one doesn't last nearly as long. I did take a hit, though. Yeah, this is pretty intense. Now I'm up against the AI. I don't like being up against the AI, but I guess that provides part of the challenge, doesn't it? Okay, I did get him somewhere, but I don't want to hit any of these baseballs because there's so many of them. Apparently he had another one. Well, screw you. So yeah, not really a whole lot else to say here, really. So another lap through here and, well not even a lap, just another round. But, yeah, he must have hit something. It's very easy to do that in battle mode. So, this will conclude the contest area. It wasn't a perfect, it wasn't like a clean sweep or anything, but it's okay. It's to be expected, so we'll just quit out. If you guys liked what you see in this video, please make sure you like, comment, do all that fun stuff, and yeah, I'll see you next time for the supposed finale of this game. Take care. Mm -hmm.